because I've been feeling a bit poopy and I feel like this will be a nice treat for me at least. So um, yes, hopefully I'll be doing another biscuit drawing and we'll just see how it goes because it may be poop. We don't know. It might be alright. Okay, so the one I'm working on hopefully will become the Victorian Garibaldi and hopefully he'll look a little bit fancy with his top hat and his waistcoat. Uh, I don't know if you can really see yet, but hopefully you will when it gets a bit mm, darker, a bit more vivid. Okay, so let's me see. Let me look at my reference. Mm -hmm. I've ever had a Garibaldi biscuit up as well, wouldn't it? I can remember exactly what they look like. Excuse me if my camera wobbles. I am typing with the camera balanced on my keyboard. There we go, that's the one. That's the ticket. Uh -huh. Having a separate thing. Gotta have all the reference up and then still also be able to see my stream. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Cool. So it's like a kind of like a sandwich biscuit. He's all wibbly wobbly. In theory, with a little bit of fruit coming out of the sides. Excuse my humming, this is Halloween. It's technically gone, been and gone. But it's also a Christmas film, which is coming, so that's alright. Oh, excuse me if I do stop singing. That happens. Oh hey! Oh, that's okay. I didn't. I didn't see your message yet anyway. Sorry. <laughs> do, 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 do. Where is it? Oh, I'm coming over my suit now. Hello, if you've just joined in. Join my Victorian Garibaldi. That's a good plan, anyway. Mm. Mm. Got the rough lines underneath, you can see, but I'm going to keep working over it. To make it a little bit... Murder. How many buttons does he have? Oh, this guy has eight buttons. Let's not be stingy on the buttons. Mm -hmm. He's also got some pockets, so let's give him less pockets. Oh, you didn't ruin anything, Steve. I can't... I don't even know what you're referring to, so don't worry about it. <laughs> it's all good. Rub out his neckerchief. Give him a nice new fancy one. It looks like this picture. Ooh. Nice and smart. Does he stick out a little... Hey, maybe this is a bit too high because it's still going to have a collar. Or in the collar. It's a high collar, so let's see. Can you see it? I don't know if you can kind of see it. It's a little bit bad covering it up. Mm -hmm. 
A little too much probably on this side. This is just Halloween, this is just Halloween, 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 Halloween. Oh, hold on. Oh no, only about like five, ten minutes. Not really any time at all. Um, where's me raisins? Where's my Garibaldi biscuit? There it is. Let's shade him a little bit. You can kind of. It's a reference for myself where they actually go. Where will the raisins will be, or whatever they put in them, currants or something, I don't know. Oof. Hmm. That's an alright pose, probably. Now, do I carry this on around the biscuit? Because then you can't see his Gary Baldy bits if I carry it around. Hmm. That's the question. Do we carry it on? Just on the front of the biscuit. Let's carry it on. It's only right. Obviously more realistic that way. Oh, that's his neckerchief. And the shirt has to follow it round as well. Do, 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 I guess you don't have to see his Gary Baldy bits here, do you? Hmm, that guy's got tails, but I don't want that. Let's give him a little pin here, though. Because he's fancy. I think that does look smarter, actually. Got a hint of a crease there. <laughs> I will. He normally ends up all right in the end, anyway. We'll have a little bit of current there and over there. And then we've got some biscuit, which is going to come round. Let's erase the squiggly. Right, now we have to draw his top hat. So it's very important that he has a doo-doo top hat. Um, so, excuse me, I'm trying to do the gesture in my hand to work it out. So that curls up. And the rim. A little higher than that. That work? I think that works. Well, you can't really see, sorry. I'm kind of working out the hat bit. Okay, so it's a bit like this. And his hand is gripping onto this bit. His hand. His biscuit tentacle. 
Sorry, I still got the. This is Halloween in my head. Oh, what is with this bit? Yuck. Ooh, this is the most difficult bit is the squiggly arms. It sounds stupid, but <laughs> I want them to look okay. Um. Hmm, something's not in the right place. I think his tentacle's too far forward now. Okay, so that's what it is. Let's get rid of that. Oh, actually, no, because I do need it to be a bit of a thing. Hmm. Trying to work out. That's not the right angle at all. So it would be the brim would actually be up, and you'd see a little bit of underneath. The guy I've got in this reference picture. Yeah, he's supposed to be a Victorian Garibaldi. So he is most fancy. Quite the dandy. Although I don't know if that's the right time period. I'm overthinking the hat and now it looks naff. Goodness. Okay, okay, let's rub this out. It's not even got to be that strong an angle, I don't think. <laughs> yeah. Well, trying to. We'll see. So, I've got, we haven't got reference of a guy that's hat is pointed up and I'm still failing. Oh, goodness. He's all right. I just need to get this bloody hat sorted. Oh, yeah, I will. Let me just bloody try and get this hat and then I'll give you a ring. Oh, oh. I'm onto something. I'm onto something. Shh. Nobody. Nobody say anything. Ah. Uh. <laughs> oh no, I've done it again. I've confused myself. Oh, hold on. Uh, trying to get that shape, but it's not having it. What if we go... Well, they're going to be round because of the angle. It's going to be round at the top, and then it's going to be... I think I'm going to have to just pick one soon and go with it. it looks a bit like a small sombrero. Don't judge me, guys. Ah. Uh... So I think oh, I kind of get it, kind of don't get it. 
Oh, it's an insult to all three things. Oh gosh. So why is it looking like a sombrero? So it's because of this. It's just... But it just comes up at the sides! How do I do it? You jerk! Stupid hat! I spent the most time on this bloody hat. The biscuit was fine. Bloody hat. It was on his head, it would be round. Round. Uh. It's just the. It's just crap. Uh. Oh, I. I know the angle's wrong as well. It doesn't help. That's better, yeah, because of the way he's lifting it up. It wouldn't be that far up at the back. Which is why it looked like a sombrero, I think. The brim is, in fact, much smaller. Good lord! It's just terrible. Just trying to draw a bloody hat. I'm doing it again. No, that's okay actually, I think. Okay. And we just go here, and then it's lifted up so it'd be kind of straight. And then his hand. Got to draw his little squiggle hand in there. Bloody hell, that's gonna do. I'm overthinking this stupid hat. Mm, yeah, it's just so fancy. No, I don't know. Does he have a cute face? What did the other ones have? Did the other ones have a cute face? That one did. He didn't. She did. She did. Oh, Grandad! Oh, he did. He didn't even have a mouth. He just had a moustache. Uh, let's just try. Yeah. Hee <laughs> hee. Winky winky. And they all get little specks. Yeah, little specks. Granddad got a little speck. She got a little speck. She got a little one too. So the boys just get a little one in the corner. Oh, yes. But that eye is too far away now. Uh, no, it's still too far away. Now that looks like he's got something wrong with him. That'll do. <laughs> the males have the syrup, special. They don't get all the sparkles like the girls do. No matter how fancy they may be. Oh, too much squiggles. Okay. Right, so he might be ready for some colouring! Let me check my Garibaldi reference. Okay, so I have some spots. I don't really want to give him spots, but it would just make him a bit more realistic, wouldn't it? Of course he's so realistic at the moment. You know how it is. Yeah, it'll do. Just a few. I hope you guys can see okay. Now I start colouring, you should be able to. Right, so... Suit colours, waistcoat colours. Um, brown. Brown's a safe colour. Now, do we go oatmeal? I think we'll go oatmeal for now. I can always go darker. 
excuse me while I fail at opening my pens for the waistcoat. Now I try and cuddle, cuddle, <laughs> colour in to beat the clock. Because if I'm not quick enough, it won't blend in correctly. And it'll be all ugly and streaky. As you can see, I'm failing. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Oh, I am working from home that day. That'll be lame. Come on. <laughs> Cuddle them. Treasure them. They are precious. The precious biscuits. Don't take your biscuits for granted, kids. Granted? Oh, man. Now I can't even speak. I'm just so overwhelmed with love for biscuits. That's clearly what it is. Okay, so his suit is on. Boop, boop. Um, okay, so his shirt is white, so we leave that. And then... Uh, a black neckerchief, because apparently that's the thing to do. Or should we try a grey neckerchief? Let's do grey. Because I don't like using too much black. It makes it too dark. 3.30. The closest thing I have to grey. What does it mean, Steve? I think I'm confused. I hope you all enjoy my wonderful sound effects. Oh, that's true. I will. I was thinking about going this week anyway. I've not been in so long that it's just be crap of me not to go this week. Um, and what colour is legs going to be? Currants colour? They could be the dark brown. <laughs> dark brown, it's like browner brown. Let's use the brown or brown. Let's see what happens. The beige, which is clearly not beige. I think this is the longest I've not been, to be honest. Um... Oh, look at his fancy legs. So fancy. His arms are white because obviously shirt. Obviously. Um, that's quite a yellow colour. Yeah, I was almost up for going last week, so it would also be rude for me not to go. 140 is a good biscuit colour. Where are you? Mellow yellow. La 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 la. La. Oh, it's a bit of a sickly colour. Is this really the colour I was? Yeah, one forty. Oh, oh, let's just go with it, shall we? Oh my God! Can you see? I'm doing really badly at this. Don't dry. I'm not done. Don't dry yet. Come on. You can do this. Boop. 
Little bit on the top, a little bit at the back. Oh, he looks a bit sickly. <laughs> yeah, I'm hoping it does. It seems to look like a pretty reasonable colour there, which is what it looks like when it's dried, so I'm hoping that's what it's like. Oh, crud! I forgot to put my guard down, and now <laughs> the ink's leaked. Crud. Never mind. Um the currents. I think I'm going to have to use that. Oh, it's not a current colour, is it? It's like a bad colour. I think it's going to have to be the beige again. The beige that isn't beige. The old currents. There we go. I might use a bit of orange at some point, or like a bit more of a golden yellow to highlight it. 602, is that beige? Which one's 602? Is that even a colour? Are you tricking me? Oh, the purple! I could add a bit of purple, actually. Let's try. Let's do it! If it ruins it, it's your fault. Just saying. No pressure. adding a little bit just to see what happens because sometimes they blend and sometimes one will overwrite the other so I don't know it looks like it'd be good I don't think you need to worry Steve looks like it's working looks like it's making the brown less the same of his legs which is pretty cool so I appreciate that good suggestion Yes, they are. They're not really brown. Going well with this, I think. Now he's extra fancy because he's got some purple. Like that. Just a little bit extra. There we go. Now it's clearly becoming purple. It's good. Yeah, you're allowed. You're all right. You got away with it. Um, his buttons. They also need to be a kind of. Are they usually gold? No, can be any color. Hmm. No. Mm, come to the buttons. Probably should just make them purple. I am thinking about making them purple if I can't pick a good colour. Not that that's very. Let's go with the maroon. That's kind of the dark red. That's kind of close. And if it doesn't work, we change it. And it's all good. Oh, that's not great. Well, the colour's fine, but my placement is not great, but um, never mind. Um, what colour is his eye going to be? I'm giving him blue, like the usual. <laughs> they are all blue-eyed. I don't know. I have some kind of issue there. Um, you could have green eyes. 520 would be a kind of cool colour. Let's give that a go. Green shadow. Ooh. You can even see that upside down. He's a very handsome chappy. With his green eye? Yes. Not very green though, is it? 
It looks almost like the grey blue. Let's see what it looks like when I've lined it. Might make it slide out a bit more. Um, and then I need... Do I want to highlight it with a little bit of golden yellow? But it's going to kind of be really, really yellow. I don't know if I want to risk it. What colour is mouth going to be? Pink, I guess. Should we use 200 for it so it's not too garish? Soft pink? Nope, pale pink. I was incorrect. Um, maybe I'll give him a little silver button. Uh, where's my silver pen? I haven't got this out in a little bit, so... Ooh, it's so shiny! Yay, he's got a little tiny silver button! Score! Oh my gosh, that smells so strong. He does, it's true. So he's just got one little silver button. Red blue. You can kind of see it in the light. I hope it's clear enough for you guys watching. Um, I need to colour in the cracks and then start giving him some shading. That's what I need to do. Got me if trend my trendy, my trusty oatmeal out. Freaked out then. Yeah, it's the right colour. Um, let me go under there as well, and um, I kind of want to do a bit more shading on this, but I don't know, I don't really want to overwork it either. Um, yay! I'm glad you could see that it was shiny. Okay, so... Let's get the next colour out to start shading. We'll get the 140 out again. I'll start giving him some texture if I can. Um... They need to be quite dark. Looks kind of green, doesn't it? Gross. So appetizing, yum. See what happens, I think. Let's just stop them again. Okay. And I'm drawing on myself. Um, I need the light blue, which I think was the one. No, 140 is yellow, I just said. 330. Pale blue. Want to see if I can add some creases to it, if possible. I'll let that dry and see if it works. Looks like it's a bit on the pale side. Let it dry again. Let's go to me brown. Well, beige, but brown. Bit of shading, bit of shading. And let's see if we can do a kind of... They kind of have pinstripes, but I don't really want to go crazy on that. Oh gosh, now he's 
This hat's got to be black, but I don't really want to do a black top hat, because like I said before, I don't want to use too much black. Um... Hmm. I'm going to start doing some outlines, I think. See how that comes out. Is it clear enough, Steve? Let me know if I need to adjust my camera. Mm -hmm. As I said before, please excuse my sound effects. Ah, oh, I did forget a patch of shading. Just beige. Oatmeal, sorry. Here, there's a crease there and I didn't even draw it out. For shame. <laughs> well, exactly, right? It's the only way that art comes out is if you make the sounds. Sorry, I didn't mean to knock the camera with my massive head. I had to start singing old Lang Syne then, jeez. Not really time for that yet. Bit early. I'm really sorry if you hear swearing in the background as well because that is my boyfriend playing Counter Strike. The least fun game ever invented. I'm sorry if you like it, it is not fun. <laughs> it is stressful. He loves it though. If you can love a game that hurts you so much. <laughs> Oh, shush. Yeah, it looks like monkey purple brains. <laughs> Should be using my smaller pen for these bits, but I'm being lazy. <laughs> I said good day. Sorry, I'm just entertaining myself. I can't even tell you what that reference is from. Oh, I've got to his legs, didn't I? Oops, I gave him thicker legs than he's supposed to have. Striking, striking. 
Looks like I need a bit more brown. I can't even remember what I said now. You're probably right though. Oh, no, I need that brown for his eyebrows. And his tiny hint of eyebrows. Oops. Hey, hey. Oh, I need to... No, I will use a thin pen for his little... Specular majigger. Um, got to his arms. Oh, got to do around his silver pin. Do some... Extra. See, I try too hard and it doesn't look as good. Foolishness. Um, pen is over here for some reason. Oh god, the hat! I'm I'm accidentally, subconsciously ignoring the hat. Too bad. Oh no, I just forgot. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, I need to do the, the lines there. Um, <laughs> ignoring the hat again. Okay. Okay. Oh, it looks terrible. But, there we are. Stick a little bit of white in the armpit there so it doesn't look... It does! Calls me all kinds of nonsense. Um... What colour? I kind of want to make it like purple or something ridiculous. Let's do maroon because then it matches his buttons. Deep red. Because I flat out don't care about this hat anymore and I'm going to colour it red if I want to colour it red. I'm going to do a bit of specular, but I'll just draw them white over the top. Look at that cowboy hat! Oh, I failed! God damn. What did I do? Did I make it too narrow? Is that what I did? It looks like a cowboy hat! No! There we go, if I just... And now we wait for that magical ink to dry. And then I can draw over it. Shut up, Steve. 
You're not supposed to agree. Sorry, there's a delay. I only just saw it. Okay. Let's just do this. And then nobody ever knows. Molly can't draw top hats. I will put a little bit over that blue because I fudged it. Why can't I write in the red again? <laughs> That's okay. It's okay because it's true. It's all true. Drive faster! My magical erase pen. Good old uh, jelly roll. Jelly roll. By Sakura. Sakura. I'm going to stop rubbing it a little bit while I wait for things to dry. Because it makes me feel good. Because it always looks a bit nicer when I rub the lines out. Makes it look a little bit more finished. Oh, I need to put some white in the collar. That one might be nice, so let's try colouring it in again. And then we wait and see if it dries all right. Let me do a little bit of this anyway because I can do this extra shading. Put it there because it's done a little bit. I need to just stop because I'm turning into a cowboy hat again. Hot damn! Um, okay. <laughs> Maybe it's the curve at the front, you know? Maybe I should have done that straight as well. Yeah, that's a bit better. Gosh, failing at simple accessories, goodness me. Why? Oh no, now it's time to look like a cowboy hat again. Ah, oh, shiz. Okay, okay everyone. I need to stop touching this hat, I'm making it worse. Oh man, okay, okay. Let's just let it dry. Let it dry. He's probably more like a cowboy now. A top hat cowboy. Let's do that. Yeah, let's forget it. He's a Wild West Garibaldi, alright? It, it still works. Let's just forget the Victorian part. We'll just rub that out. No one saw it. Cowboy. <laughs> There you go! I haven't seen Westworld, so I'll have to call him Cowboy for now, but... Still works. Thank you, Steve, for your vote of confidence. But now I feel like I should have left it cowboy shape. <laughs> Let's change all my fixes and make it like a cowboy top hat. And then I'll go and have a little cry after, be fine. Okay, he's sending me a link. I'll have to check in a second when I've got over myself a bit. See, it's kind of a top hat. Mm. <laughs> kind of, kind of works well enough. The scruffiest cowboy you ever did saw. All right, I'm gonna look at that picture you've sent me now, Steve. Bear with me, everyone. Can't really, I can't really share it unless you can see it. But he's got a hybrid hat because he's special. Okay, everyone? Hybrid hat. That's a thing. Hybrid top hat, cowboy hat. For when you need to herd the cattle, but you also want to look super smart. In case you have any meetings, you know. With the mayor or something. Maybe you are the mayor. 
you also like riding horses. That's maybe that's what this guy is. Done. Oh gosh, I think I've killed my pen. This has run out. Might have. Oh, he's the most fancy of the cowboys. Okay. I can get behind that. Oh no, I think we're good. I thought my pen had died, but we're good. I just clogged it up with my excessive amount of trying to fix this. But I'm not going to bother trying to change the shape of it. It can just be a fancy top hat. <laughs> I agreed it's fine. Here we go. Right. Okay. Okay, guys. It's starting to come together a little bit. Oh. All right, then. We lost the first half. On, a, on the half that's the, the easiest, we lost. Right. 11-4. They were just shitting on us, like really bullshit on us. Yeah. And I was just leaning back to my chair like this done. Yeah. Second half. We got in the zone, mate. You won everything. We won like ten rounds in a row and then it went to overtime. And then we we won all four rounds in a row in overtime. Well there you go. Yeah, you that, yeah. But you did it! Grinded that game out. Good job. If we had lost, I would have cried. Yeah. But you did it, so yay! That was my boyfriend updating us all on his DS match. It went well in the end. Now to try and erase around the hat while it dries. I think I think that was a good save. Thank you, Steve. I think he looks all right as a small hatted top hat cowboy Garibaldi. Now I'm just going to erase some more mistakes. Wee with this magical pen. It fixes all things. When Molly cocks up, it fixes them, makes them go away. Boom! Oh, let's get rid of this little foot thing. I'll do it, give him a I'll do him a shadow. Hey yeah, right! They're probably the same time period, not really, maybe. We don't know. I don't know. I drew through his leg. Mistake. It's okay. We can just do a few dabs. I'm gonna colour over it. Right, let's see, this is dried. Seems so. Let's find out. Now is the big test. Oh, shiz! First fail. It's alright, I'll fix it. Just gently. Gently bendly. Right, I need to just tidy, tidy up the shadow a little bit. I might do. Oh, I'm opening the wrong end of my pen. Oh shit! He's got a really scruffy hat now. Never mind. These things happen, especially to me. It's fine. Um, just need the brown. 
Ready to go. Okay, so let me put my stuff away and give him a proper look over. Clean up my mess. Have a bit of water. Okay. Little mis rubber shavings off my desk. Okay, so I think he's rubbed all the lines out of him. As best I can currently. Okay. Let me see if I can show him off a little better. Here we go. He's a dapper chap. With his super dodge emergency cowboy hat. Just ignore that bit, it's fine. And his kind of table, you know, dining table, chair, legs. But don't look at that either. It's fine. Watch his little glinty pin, because we like a little bit of metallic. Awesome. Okay. I think that's going to be it for now. Um, but I might play... Mm, I might be on tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to be playing games tonight. We'll see. Ah, oh, thank you. That would be cool and appreciated if that was a thing. But um, yeah, thank you for watching, I guess, whoever, whoever is watching. Um, no thanks to Steve. No, many thanks to Steve. You're always watching. I appreciate it. Um, and yeah, so feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. Because I don't have a schedule. Um, that's the only way you'll find out when I'm online. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon.